I hope you are checking out your local farmers markets. I don't care where you live. That's the place where you get the freshest, best produce. But there is some method to shopping a farmers market. So we went to the experts. The three chefs are here. <laughs> Yeah, this, this is, is drool worthy for yes. anyone that is into fresh food, which really should be everybody, yep, right? Totally. You want everything to be fresh. Uh, there's certain things that come in and out of season, and you sort of have to have a sense of what's happening so that you know what you might expect well, to find. I, I think the biggest thing with seasons is the good thing is the farmer knows, the plant knows, yes. you know, the market knows. Um, the only thing is, as long as if you go there, you're going to find out what's in season. Mm -hmm. It's just if you're looking for something specific and you missed it. Yes. You know. But right now, I mean, all the cherries are happening. It's all the. But think of it also Cheers. as the younger things that are happening, the things that've got shorter growing seasons. But the other great thing is when you go to the farmers market, they're also actually filled by some of the hot houses as well. Okay. Like these tomatoes are coming out of hot houses right now. Yes. So you know, you're kind of thinking like, wait a minute, how are we haven't. But you've got local grown, beautiful tomatoes, yeah, yeah, right? Absolutely. And yeah. they're yeah. flavorful. They're not been on a truck for two days yeah. you know mm -hmm. and I mean everything's happening right now you know you got the radishes are always first to get in there you know nice bite to anything you do the salads um, pickling them down the potatoes are happening obviously the young potatoes at the beginning of the year yep. um, and there's something about taking something local and just letting it shine yes. you know like don't mess with it too much but the flavor is going to be better you know, for you all the zucchinis are yeah. happening right now the peppers um, you know cucumbers for me are, the, are always the exciting things because again it's it's summer it's fresh Delicate flavors. It's got garlic, right? Yeah, it's garlic. fresh it's young garlic. garlic. Yeah, so what would, be, this what would have a shorter, yeah. what has a short, short season? You so know, the like there's certain things like you want to get in days. there quickly. Yeah, exactly. 21 days later, you got okay. radishes. Okay. It's been a great season this year because there's been so much rain. Yes. Everything's just been oh, yeah, steroids. Yeah. Nice yes. and yeah. 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 Cherries, too. Cherries, Cherries are early, just right? Now, yeah. Cherries are early. You know, strawberries are early. Even the little baby carrots have short growing season, things like that. Peas are happening. And, you know, and then soon we'll start moving over to the bigger fruit, like the, you know, the peaches, the plums, but, you know, that's how your seasons work along, right? Okay, but, now let's get into yeah, my favorite area of the market, the yeah. baked goods, shall the we? Baking, oh. The baked goods, yeah. What it's do we expect <laughs> to find in this area? Yeah. What are we looking for? You know what? The, you, you can find everything from bread to pies to uh, muffins to uh, tarts, oh. yes. anything you want, really. I mean, you just have to find the right time of uh, of the day to go there because right. you know what? The, the, the later you go and the less stuff you're going to find. Sometimes you show up at like 10 o'clock yeah, right. and all the donuts are gone. If Massimo got that, I'm into butter tarts. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, oh, butter you tarts have to go early. Yeah. I you mean, do. we never, yeah. ever, ever get bread at our farmer's market Absolutely. because we're yeah. never on time. Get it to know quick. the people at the farmer's market because you say, you know what, I'm going to come Every week, right. but put six aside for me. Yeah, done. Yes. Save, save it for me. That's that's the. Uh, the, the other thing yeah, is yeah. get to know the farmers yeah. of the farmers market because usually they have bakeries too, and once they sell out the farmers market, you just mm. go to their store. Yeah, that's true. Right, yeah. just that's same. true. That's, that's true. true. That's true. Yeah. That's true. Absolutely. Okay, then yeah. we get into sort of the syrups, the jams, yeah. which you know you know all about. Come on, take your brush your hair. Um, <laughs> in Canada, like this is like this is our gold right here. Forty liters of sap turns into one liter of syrup. It's absolutely magical stuff. You take this anywhere else on the planet and everyone's like, they just don't understand how yeah. delicious it is and they don't have it around. So yeah. go to the market, make sure you always have some of that okay. in your uh, in your pantry. Fresh eggs, oh. uh, make sure you get some beef <clears throat> pollen for your um, salads and all that kind of stuff. Yeah. Very nice, yeah. okay, great selection. You just kind of have to take what you get, right? It's like shopping, don't have the specific list. No. I'm thinking about the, right. the specific dress you're looking for, throw that out the window and get yeah. whatever dress is on sale. 